It's Wednesday the 27th of July, I'm Lee Wilde. A man is currently in hospital after he was attacked with an axe in Stockport. Shortly after 5 o'clock yesterday morning, police were called to reports of an assault on Nelstrop Walk. When they arrived, they found a 39-year-old man with serious head injuries. He was taken to hospital where he remains in a serious but stable condition. A 41-year-old man has been arrested on suspicion of assault and is currently in police custody. A man from Oldham is wanted after breaching his licence conditions. Police are searching for 60-year-old Brian Warren, who was released on licence from prison two years ago after being convicted of sexual assault in 2011. It's thought that he could be in the Oldham area but has links to the rest of Greater Manchester. Anyone with any information of Warren's whereabouts should call police on 101 or the charity Crime Stoppers anonymously on 0800 treble 5 treble 1. The £21.7 million replacement for Glossopdale Community College has come a couple of steps closer. Planning permission has been given and it's been confirmed that those who develop the design and build scheme, Midlands-based Henry Brothers, will be undertaking the work. The new school is set to replace the split college site which currently operates from Talbot Road in Glossop and Newshaw Lane in Hadfield. Preliminary work will start soon with the building expected to open in the winter of next year. And finally the weather. Clear and warm out for today with highs of 18 degrees but that won't last as heavy rain is forecast for tomorrow. We're set to see around 11mm of rain following the Tameside area before drying up towards Friday in the weekend.